Vice Chairman Steve Rhodes is Laura Sheehan. Is Rose Walker. Okay, Donald, and she is here, Donald McKenzie. Bill Gaylor. Present. Uh, Ranking Member Ellen Birnbaum. Here. Laura Curran. Here. And Arnold Drucker. Here. We have a quorum. We have one item before us. That is item 5 of 2017, an ordinance supplemental to the annual appropriation ordinance in connection with the Department of Public Works. Good afternoon. Uh, Ken Hall Public Works, good afternoon. Could you just give us a brief... Uh... Yes. Yes, the uh, department through NYSERDA received a grant for $100,000 to do a microgrid study for the Bay Park East Rockaway community as it pertains to the Bay Park Sewage Treatment Plant. So this study, the department will be looking at ways to help the local village utilizing some of the power facilities that are at the Bay Park facility. If I might, uh, there was a, a motion made by a legislator Gaylor, seconded by Rose Walker. Uh, do we have any questions on this item? Yes, Ms. Schaefer. Absolutely. Ms. Curran, the other board. Hi. Could you please explain more what this means using the so the, the surrounding community can use the power facility, the power yeah. line, the power from the facility? How does that work? Uh, Bay Park produces all its own power for the treatment facilities. In addition, it has is behind Maui completed protective barrier. Uh, this would look to help the local village hall, fire department, or other municipal facilities within the East Rockaway community, whether they could utilize the excess power during the emergency. And so this is a, a state grant to, to make that happen? Or to make study? It, to study it. To study it, got it. If I might, this grant went to the, the incorporated village, or it went to us? Went to the county. It went to the county specifically for the incorporated village. Yeah, there are there are other parts of the county that the villages and towns have gotten these types of grants, but in this case, the county received the grant. And it is conditioned that it be used for the village of East Rockaway. The East Rockaway Bay Paul community. Yes, this particular grant. Okay, just bear Did the village of East Rockaway initiate the process of this grant? I believe this came out of the scoping sessions that were done by New York State as part of the community we, we, the community CR program when they looked at all the different problems associated with Hurricane Sandy and they met with the various communities. They were looking for different solutions to different problems. Microgrids were brought up at that point and I believe that's where that came from and there were village people on those review boards, review committees. And is that the normal process for NYSERDA to give the grant to the county to give to the local? I'm, I'm not sure if that's the normal process. This is a question. Ms. Burbank, do you have more questions? Or? Uh, no, that's my question. Thank you. So this is not just solely uh, contained within the village of East Rockaway. Uh, Bay Park is the community that sits out immediately outside of the uh, treatment facility. <coughs> Um, they would they would see the primary benefit of a micro grid, yeah. and I guess the uh, village of East Rockaway then could piggyback on it as well. So it's, it's, it's not all within a village, it's town or county as well benefits. Well, it's looking to connect municipal facilities, so other than maybe uh, street lighting, the only municipal facilities that are down there are for the village. So there's a railroad that runs through there as well. Would, do they benefit from this? Possibly, yeah, I'm not sure if that's within the study, the study scope of what we're looking to do. I know the emergency, uh, the emergency response facilities, which would include the fire department, village hall, and the public works facility, and these rock are the ones that I believe are the focus of the study. Okay, thank you. It, it, it's my understanding. I don't know if you know this is true or not, but I've, I've just been told that the East Rockway Fire Department are the first responders for the Bay Park that's Treatment true. Center. Is that correct? That's true. Okay. I, I, honestly, I, I don't know whether this is the way this normally happens, or it doesn't normally happen this way, or if the county has to be the vehicle through which this passes, but it seems to me that if that's in fact the case, that, that East Rockaway is the primary first responder for Bay Park, and Bay Park is a county facility, that this is something that well, I don't have any objection to, but I uh, and perhaps if we have additional questions with respect to how this actually works, 
we can ask and get those things answered before uh, before we vote on this. But if there are no other questions, I just yes, have, Mr. Drucker. What other sewage treatment center uh, plants are eligible? I'm not sure eligibility is the right term. Uh, this kid, I know that in the Cedar Creek also, but this is its own power, but there was no um, discussion of using that as a microgrid for all the communities. So I'm not sure. I think this came out of the CR committee's discussions of how we can help that community that was totally lost power during Sandy and how they can keep some of their operations up and running. So I'm not sure, you know, this, this grant was given to us by NYSER. I'm not sure what that criteria, why they selected Nassau County. No, I'm just I'm curious if you know or are aware of any other treatment plants that might have to have this microgrid as well. I don't know, I know. But question, please. So does, does each of the treatment plants have their own microgrids already, or is this, the microgrid that was installed at Bay Park was a byproduct of the Hurricane Sandy. Well, let me back up to nothing. All, all, all the county uh, sewage treatment plants produce power. Uh, Glen Cove produces only backup power. Its primary feed is LIPA, or uh, Neo Power Authority. Um, there was no, so this is looking at how we could utilize the, the power at Bay Park to support the Sunny community during an event where their first uh, power source, which would be uh, PSC and G, was lost. So right now this is looking at a study of is it feasible, what would, if feasible, what would we look to connect? The second part is, which probably would be a separate grant that we would compete for, would be to supply the equipment to do that connection. And, and, and Thank you. would I be correct in, in maybe assuming that Whatever this study finds in terms of the feasibility of Bay Park to provide the microgrid, that might be usable in other treatment facilities yeah, but the, of a similar type. I would think that would be a good subject. There would be certain parts of that study that would be programmed no matter what the treatment facility would be. Okay. Any other questions? Hearing none, any public comment? All those in favor of moving this item on, please say aye. Aye. Any opposed? The item carries unanimously, there being no further business. Uh, motion by Rose Walker to adjourn, seconded by Mr. Gaylor. All those in favor? Aye. aye. Any opposed? We are adjourned. Next up is finance.